Hey, I'm Alexander Lewis, and I'm gonna make a beat with whatever's in this crate. What's up? What's up? What's up? Bitch. turn into a bitch now a bitch now you don't turn into a bitch now let's see what's inside <laughs> okay oh, Jesus red solo cups and we got let's see what else we got here we got flexible straws a hundred of them in case I need multiple we have a clock <laughs> we have handcuffs with keys, that's important. And a bingo thing. And there are cards to go with it. First thing I'm gonna sample. Let's see here. Let's see what else. Let's see if I can get. Ooh, yeah, that's it. Tight. Fire. We'll start with many. All right, and then we'll just try using one. Oh wait, hold on. A bunch of these straw sounding asses. That's cool. Haha, <laughs> this is gonna be fun. Whoa! <laughs> Oh, balls are flying everywhere. I'm gonna find these in like a week. That's a cool sound. What if I just... <laughs> yeah, I'm definitely gonna find these from a, week, a week from now. <laughs> Tight. All right, I'm gonna go through the sounds right now and figure out which ones I want to manipulate. Cool, so we're gonna take that. Oh yeah, that's it, that was the one. Oh yeah, all these are great. So we'll take these crunching sounds and layer it with a snare probably. Deflect straws. Okay, we already really have a shaker sound, so that's... Ah, there it is, That there's that rip sound. Cool, we'll use those. I like that the best, so we we'll use that of the f straw and solo cup combination. Let's move on to the handcuffs. Could layer that with a snare too. Over here we have the ringing. I'm just kind of interested to hear what the clock is gonna sound like in the sampler. Let's see. Let's reverse it. That's no, tight. Warp it. I'm just gonna loop that. It sounds awful as a chord, but it'll sound good as a monophonic instrument. Now what I'm gonna try to do, zoom into a part of the sample to where I can make it a polyphonic instrument so I can play chords. There we go. Okay. Cool. Now it's like really, really harsh right now, so we'll throw a reverb. Just transpose it down to... Fix the tuning of it. Cool. Let's see what I got out of this bingo machine. <laughs> I 
Oh yeah, those are the cards. Okay, these are the the bingo cards. I uh, like opened up the cage. That one. Drop it into a simpler. Okay, so that's a B flat. It's got to go down three semitone. So that's a concert C now. All right, I have my sounds that I'm gonna manipulate. Start picking out some drum samples. Like this, this I am. Probably lay some type of sub. A lot of the bounciness from the beat will come from the hi-hat and, and all the added textures that I have from the recorded samples. I'm gonna cool. put a little harmony on there. Oh shit, that was a mistake, and that was tight. All right, so we use that little clock sound. You know what, I think I'm gonna use the same pad that I used and just make it a different, a completely different instrument. Layer something under that just to give it some more, some more meat. Nice bass. Oh, that's cool, actually. Crunch from the solo cup could actually be used as maybe a hi-hat if I manipulate it the right way. The flanger makes it kind of gives it gives it some tones. A lot of the time melody comes first, but I like to sit down at the computer and be able to like really figure out the harmony of the song then everything else falls into place. Yeah, something like that. All right, I'm all done. Happy with where it's at. It's definitely challenging. It was a lot of fun though. What up squad, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, you can hit the subscribe button. You can also follow us on Twitter and Instagram by clicking the links below. Until next time, thanks for watching All Deaf Music.